Hope you guys are doing well. So here's your workout for tomorrow, on uh, Thursday, May 28th. All right, starting with your warm up. So we have five inchworms, followed by 10 push ups. Then with a jump rope, you're gonna do 20 single unders. Then you're gonna do a 20 one legged single unders on your right leg, followed by 20 one legged single unders on your left leg. Uh, 20 one legged singles is a little too much. Uh, just go ahead and alternate between the right and left, like 101 or three and three. Uh, that's fine, just try to get 20 done per leg. If you do not have a jump rope, instead of doing all the singles, just go ahead and do 40 jumping jacks instead. Cool? Uh, we're gonna cycle through all of that for two rounds. Then, your no equipment option for tomorrow is a 400 meter run or 50 double unders, followed by 15 pull-ups. Uh, if you don't have a pull-up bar at home, uh, pick some sort of row, um, a row of any kind, uh, whether it be a body row, a bent over row with dumbbells or kettlebells you can use a couple gallons of water a case of water a backpack your kid um something okay so bent over row just make sure that we're hinged at the hip um that our shoulders are retracted back the entire way through all right um and that our arms are extended all right and then we're pulling to the straight to the chest okay uh then we have 10 handstand push-ups if we do not have handstand push-ups we'll go ahead and sub push presses uh, if we don't have anything to do push presses with, we can go ahead and just do normal push ups. But, uh, so for these push ups, I want again chest all the way down to the ground as always. Um, and then as we push up, instead of ending in that plank position, what I want you to do is I want you to end in a downward dog position. All right, so again, nose towards your knees and your butt piked up in the air. And what this will do, this will just kind of help load your shoulders a little bit more uh, to kind of help mimic a handstand push up a little bit better than a normal push-up. All right, um, and we're gonna do this three rounds, four time, okay? Then your limited equipment option is very similar with only one change, all right? Um, it's 30 calories for guys, 20 calories for girls on a rower, a skier, or a bike, all right? The uh, rest, rest of it's the same. So again, 15 pull-ups and then 10 handstand push-ups. Again, three rounds, four time, all right? Being that it's only three rounder, try to push the pace on this one a little bit, especially on the the run the ski bike or row all right try to push the pace on that probably looking at anywhere from like 12 to 15 minutes give or take um depending on what cardio piece you pick or what mods you might do all right then our strength we have a six by two bench press all right so if you've been keeping up with that strength keep it up um essentially we're trying to work up to a heavy double for the day um <clears throat> so again if we don't have if we have limited weight uh, or if we have dumbbells or kettlebells instead, that's fine. If we don't have a bench, you can do floor press. That's fine too. Uh, work that tempo um, if our weight's a little bit limited, okay? Um, our endurance option. So we have a 400 meter run or a 500 meter row. All right, you're gonna rest one minute and do this for eight rounds. Cool. Then your midline is 15 second intervals. We have a hollow hold, all right, followed by tuck ups. And then we have sit-ups, and then we have a rest. All right, we're going to do all of that for six rounds. Again, 15 seconds each. Uh, keep in mind for the hollow hold. Uh, hollow hold, we want your trunk to be like the base of a rocking chair or happy banana, whatever you want to call it, right? So you want, essentially, the only thing touched on the ground is going to be the small part of your back. If that form starts to break, modify your, modify your movement, all right? So again, we want... One knee tucked or both knees tucked, all right? So do, do modify as needed, all right? Especially as fatigue sets in, cool? Well, that's it. Good luck, guys. Um, keep crushing it. Hope you guys see, see you guys on Saturday at the track at 9.30. All right, if you guys have any questions, again, reach out. Thanks.